So cleaning your Best of the West muzzleloader is pretty easy and straightforward. So we recommend cleaning it every 15 to 20 shots. So our first step in cleaning the muzzleloader is verifying that it's unloaded. So check your breech plug, make sure there's, that's empty, and make sure that there's no charge in there. And we're clear. Take a patch. These are inch and three quarter patches. Use your favorite uh, carbon remover and get your patch damp. It doesn't need to be soaking wet, just get it damp. Lay that on your bore, center it up. Make sure when you're pushing that in there that you don't have any, that you're not damaging the crown. So just be cautious of that. And run that in there. Now one, uh, one feature our short starter has, it's a good time to show this, is on the back side of that there's a threaded stud. So that stud will thread into your ramrod and give you a good handle for, for cleaning. So now you can pull that up and pull that out. So now you can take that, flip it over, and run it again. So a little carbon there, let's try another one. Get that damp. Sometimes that'll get stuck. You can use a little pocket knife or something and pull that through. Flip that around. Again, run it through there again. So we're fairly clean. I'm going to call that clean. So let's try a dry one. Let's try one more, just to make sure we've got all that solvent out of there. That should be good. That feels pretty dry and that should be good. So as far as cleaning goes, uh, you're done. Uh, because we use Blackhorn 209, um, it is not necessary to, to remove the, the breech plug. Um, it burns super clean and it just doesn't build up like the old black powder guns do. Um, in the event that you do need to remove it, this is how. So start by removing your bolt. And in your, in your kit comes a, a removal tool and it's got an O-ring on it. So when you slide that in, You'll feel the O-ring engage and you'll feel it push in. Make sure it goes past the O-ring. Um, use a ratchet and it's a 5 8 socket. And loosen that up. So there's your breech plug. Um, while you've got it out, there's no harm in cleaning it up, use some solvent, and get all the gunk off of it. Now when you reapply it, there should be some anti-seize in your kit, so make sure that you reapply the anti-seize. Um, it's even not a bad idea to wrap it with some plumber's tape, some Teflon tape, and then put a little bit of anti-seize on, and then reinstall it. And then we'll install this back into the rifle.
Okay, when you get that all the way seated, this doesn't have to be super tight, so just give that a little bit of a, a little snug, and that's all it takes. It doesn't have to be super tight. Put the tool back out and reinstall the bolt, and it's done. So after cleaning your rifle, we do recommend a fouling shot because a clean bore will change your point of impact. This typically only takes one shot, but don't be concerned about the residue. Blackhorn fouling will not hurt your bore.